I'm Dr. Sahil Khanna. I am a gastroenterologist at Mayo Clinic, Rochester, and my special interests include C. difficile infection, fecal transplant, and inflammatory bowel disease. Over the last few years, we've seen a trend for new treatments for C. difficile infection. One of the most promising treatments has been fecal transplant with success rates of over 90%. Fecal transplant is a treatment where healthy bacteria from a healthy person can be implanted into a patient with C. difficile infection and can lead to symptom resolution in a few days. This treatment has also been explored for other disease entities, most popularly inflammatory bowel disease. Inflammatory bowel disease includes Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. There are case reports that say that fecal transplant may be effective for patients with inflammatory bowel disease. However, there are other case reports that say fecal transplant may not be effective for patients with inflammatory bowel disease. A recent case published in a patient with C. difficile and inflammatory bowel disease showed that fecal transplant actually led to worsening of ulcerative colitis after C. difficile was treated. At this time, there are several clinical trials that are undergoing for fecal transplant for inflammatory bowel disease, for ulcerative colitis, and Crohn's disease. In 2013, there is no clear-cut evidence that fecal transplants work for Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis, and these treatments should be undertaken only under research protocols.